teach science for two hours a week, four years, three, four, five, and six. And um, we cover physics, chemistry, and biology. And we still call them physics, chemistry, and biology. The emphasis really is on investigational work. I think my job is to enthuse the children and to inspire them and to teach them to love science, which most of them do. And I think everything, everyone gets something out of science, even if it's not their specialist subject. If you can inspire them, then they tend to go off and do their own research and um, find th out things themselves. I'm forever getting into trouble because children have gone home and dug big holes in gardens looking for worms and bugs, but that's what it's all about. I mean, I got caught this morning on the playground with a bird's nest from somebody, so <laughs> things like this, you know, all sorts of things come into school, from leaving bread to go mouldy in my airing cupboard through to eating an apple upside down to see if you can actually swallow when you're standing on your head, um, to investigating bugs in the bog garden, all sorts of things really. I think the key is to get children to question and if they can come up with questions then they can, you can teach them to investigate and find out the answers for themselves. In science you've got all sorts of English skills which are being used, and handwriting to comprehension, neatness of work, there are mathematical skills being used, it's, it's vital really.